All right, what's up, guys, and welcome back to another episode of Assassin's Creed 3. So we currently find ourselves in sequence three, and I'm going to be completely honest as a YouTuber. It's really hard to make videos and not go through your comments like it's just it's a fun thing for me to do personally to go through the comments. And I was seeing that some of you guys are telling me that the game hasn't even begun yet, that it takes a couple more sequences for the real thing to actually start, you know, becoming what this game is meant to become, if that makes any sense. But anyways, I see comments that this is just still the introductory phase, which is kind of crazy. Um, so I searched up how many sequences we have in this game, fearing that it was going to be like 20 or 30. But uh, there's only like 11 or 12. So what I'm going to be doing moving forward is every single episode is going to be a sequence. So with that said, this video might be a little bit shorter than the last ones, which have been over an hour. And then the ones after this will just be based on how long that sequence is. I just feel like it's going to be a little bit more structured for you guys and just for myself in general. And uh, yeah, we are officially out of Boston. I'm pretty sure we'll go back. We are now at the frontier or in the frontier and I'm excited, man. Okay. I am excited. We're supposed to meet with, uh, Jesus. I forgot her name. Zo, Zo Z starts with a Z Zori Zoe. I don't know. Oh my God. I'm sorry. Okay. But the very beautiful Indian young woman that we rescued a couple of episodes ago, if you've missed any of the episodes, I suggest check them out. You know, if that's something you're into, I, I think it'd be cool. <laughs> Okay, I'm just gonna shut up now. I can't believe that this is just the beginning. Like, how crazy? That, that just sounds super crazy to me. Okay, so we're gonna take this horse, obviously. And we're headed this way. So I don't know exactly how much bigger the map is in comparison to... Uh, hello? Okay. I don't know how much bigger this map is uh, comparing it to some of the other AC games that we've played. I want to say that it's obviously bigger. Um, I just, I'm not sure how much bigger. I mean, we know that historically AC maps get bigger and bigger and bigger. I mean, I remember thinking there's no way a game could be bigger than Odyssey's map or there's no way the next AC game can be bigger than Odyssey. And let me tell you, man, it was. Okay, Valhalla was absolutely gigantic. I'm sorry. I keep hitting this horse for no reason. I feel bad. <laughs> this horse hates me. But look at how much life there is here. All right, guys. We're here. Excellent. Ooh, there's a lot of guards there. Holy smokes. Shut up. Execution is everything. Use the snowstorm to mask your approach. Having second thoughts? Hardly. But I'll have to approach this carefully. Go on then. I'll keep watch from here. Hmm. I can hide in that cart. Oh, so do not kill any soldiers using any weapon. Well, how the hell do you expect me to do that? I'm an assassin, man. I mean, am I an assassin? I don't freaking know. As you wish, uh, let's see. Two barrels of salt, 12 pounds of pork, 10 pounds of beef, seven dozen eggs, 16 wheels of cheese. None of it French, don't worry. Oh. Five bottles of whiskey, a <laughs> couple dozen new uniforms, boots, a leather for patching, blankets to cut feed for the horses. What else? That's it. Bro, put on a hoodie or something, man. You're bald. It's cold as hell outside. <laughs> it's crazy, man. Crazy ass white boy. Those cannons are like to cause trouble. Perhaps I could sabotage them. Ooh, eavesdrop. On the officer. Okay, how the hell am I... How do you expect as expect me to do any of this? Hmm. Oh. Oh 
my god. Oh my god, there's a soldier looking this way. This would be so much easier if I could just kill him. Honestly, I'm about to just F the optional objective and just kill them all. Literally, just kill all of them. Okay, good. Tell me you good news. General Braddock refused the offer. There will be no truth. Damn it. Why don't you? What reason did he give? He said a diplomatic solution was no solution at all. That allowing the French to retreat would only delay an inevitable conflict. One in which they now have the upper hand. There's merit to those words. As much oh as my I God. to admit it. Still, can't he see this is unwise? He doesn't fit wrong with me either. We're far from home with our forces divided. Worse, I fear Braddock's bloodlust makes him careless. It puts the men at risk. I'd rather not be delivering grim news to mothers and widows because the bulldog wanted to prove a point. Where is the general now? Rallying the troops. And then it's on to Fort Duquesne, I assume? Eventually. The march north will surely take time. There's a copy of the plans in the command center should you wish to review them. At least this will be ended soon. I tried, John. I know, my friend. I know. That map will surely be of nice. use. I need to find it. So one thing I've noticed in this game is that depending on like the trigger has an adapt it's got like a like a sensor. If you pull the trigger slightly, you run a little bit slower. And if you pull it all the way, it's much faster. I just figured that out uh, on the last episode and I forgot to mention it, but I thought it was so cool. Please don't spot me. Hold on. I'm going to hide here. This guy's going to turn back around. The guy on top of me, he's going to look. And then as soon as he flips, we're flipping. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right, so there's one more cannon. Oh my god. <gasps> oh my god. Bro, I'm not built for this, man. This is... Oh my goodness. He's right in front of me. This guy is fucking blind. <laughs> I mean, come on, dude. Wow, that was a close call. Okay, good. We made it here. So I'm going to wait for him to come back. I'm trying to at least do something right, right? Like do it 100%. And this is going to be that mission. Or at least this portion. And then we'll probably fail. But that's okay. Because then the real assassin will be born. And you will emerge. You kill all you assholes. Steal a tactical map. Are you fucking kidding me? Now I gotta go for the map. Okay, so the tactical map is that way. Okay. Let's see. I don't know if I'm going to be able to pull this off, boys. This, this is just a little bit too dangerous. Was it here all along? Yo. I don't know if I saw that there. I do not remember. Okay, when this guy flips, I'm out of here. Nice. Perfect. He's going to go here and then he's going to turn around and steal the map. And it's going to be like there was nobody ever here. Oh 
Oh, crap. Dude, he's going to see me. <gasps> oh. oh, my God. He's fucking blind. Okay, so I can't... I cannot head out that way. There's just too many guards there. Okay, so I'm going to wait for this guy to turn back around. Fuck it. Yeah. There's only one guard here, so I think this... This might just be the way. <gasps> oh my goodness. Holy cow. Okay, hold on. How am I leaving? Good, 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 good. Ooh. There we go. I think we did it. Perfect. Look at that. We actually did it. Do not kill any guards. That's 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 a first, okay? It's definitely a first for me. Perfect. What news? Radicus left to rally his troops. They're marching on Fort Duquesne. It'll be a while yet till they're ready, which gives us time to form a plan. No need. We will ambush them here near the river. Go and gather your allies. I will do the same. I will send word when it is time to strike. Okay. Execution is everything. Look at us getting 170 out of 170. Holy smokes. 100% completion rate. You don't see that every day. She. I'm just saying. Okay, so now we got to find a horse. I don't know if this game expects me to run all the way over there. All right, we're here. Let's get it. Five months later? What? In the cold, cold ground. Here, here. Hard at work, I see. How did you? <laughs> it is time. We've set up camp to the north. Meet me there. Gentlemen. Let us away. Damn, dude, I was not expecting it to be five months later. First it was too cold. Now it's too goddamn hot. And humid too. It's a right swamp, I tell you. To say nothing of the mosquitoes. Warm weather and bugs are soon to be the least of our worries. For real? What? You mean the bulldog? Huh. Please. We'll be in that one's beef soon enough and on to the next. Where's your boy Lee gone off to? Returned to finish out his service under Braddock. I imagine the Bulldog's none too pleased after the stunt we pulled. Pleased to spin a tale of my incompetence and beg forgiveness. He is away with words, especially when it comes to flattery. I expect he'll be welcomed back with open arms. Which would give us a man inside. Precisely. Unless you've underestimated our enemy. If I have, Charles will sense it first and make his escape. He's more clever than you think. When this is done, I'm taking a week in New York. It's high time I went and saw the sights. Of empty whiskey bottles and women's breeches, no doubt. Hmm. <laughs> what other kinds of sights is worth seeing?
I see you've been busy. All these men are from many different tribes, united in their desire to see Braddock sent away. The Abenaki, the Lenape, the Shawnee. And you? Who do you stand for? Myself. What would you have me do? Well, you will help the others to prepare. Follow. They come. Everything all right, sir? Just savoring the moment. No doubt, many wonder why it is we've pushed so far west. These are wild lands as yet untamed and unsettled. But it shall not always be so. In time, our holdings will no longer suffice. And that day is closer than you think. We must ensure our people have ample room to grow and further prosper. Which means we need more land. The French understand this and endeavor to prevent such growth. They skirt around our territory, erecting forts and forging alliances, awaiting the day they might strangle us with the noose they've built. This must not come to pass. We must sever the cord and send them back. This is why we ride, to offer them one last chance. The French will leave, or they will die. Now is the time to strike. Wait. To scatter the expedition is not enough. We must ensure that Braddock falls, else he's sure to try again. I'll disguise myself as one of his own and make my way to his side. Your ambush will provide the perfect cover for me to deliver the killing blow. Oh, shit. So, clear the scout camp. Targets killed. Kill militia without triggering open conflict. We are waiting yeah. for signal. There, in front of us. Bro, you know what? Fuck that. If I trigger a signal, it is what it is. Okay, so do I. Hold on. There he is. There's my target. Ooh. Kill them! Oh, dude, I didn't have my assassin laid out. Oh, there's that. So much for being stealthy. Hello? Master Mr. Canway? I don't think so, son. It's a little sloppy. It's okay. Got the job done. Of course. Of course. I'm not surprised that I was going to fail that side objective. It's fine. Ooh, look at the Indians just moving around. That's so fucking cool. <laughs> oh, damn, son. I'm telling you, how could anyone call this high. forest the home? Ground is it's uneven. all it's dangerous. Thugs it's and monstrous things. With the, the French pushback, there'll be a lot of opportunities for us up north. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. This reminds me of Red Dead. I don't know why. It does. Sir, you are grateful to have served. General! Edward. Not so fun on the other end of the barrel, is it? Look out! Oh, Sir. shit. Look at this little Where piece of shit. Where are you off to, Edward? 
Yo, this game is lit, bro. Let's get it. Where, where am I going? This way. Okay. My, my fl uh, flint knock pistol now, huh? Okay, not a problem. Uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. So many things thrown I at me at once. For a coward, Edward. Come on, then. Not the Such fucking horse. Arrogance. I always knew it would be the end of you is the end of you. Oh, shit. Don't. Hurry before he gets away. I said go! <laughs> Damn, she's crazy. Okay. I don't deserve this! Come here, Braddock. I will kill you! You stupid slimy dog! You're a hypocrite, Hatham! I'm sorry, Edward! But you forced my hand! <laughs> I wanted to use the gun, I'm sorry. Okay, I'm really sorry. Unless there was some sort of cool assassination. <sighs> Why, Hatham? Your death opens a door. It's nothing personal. Well, maybe it is a little personal. Been a pain in my ass, after all. But we are brothers in arms. Once, perhaps. No longer. Do you think I've forgotten what you did? All those innocents slaughtered, and for what? It does not engender peace to cut your way to resolution. Wrong. Whether we applied the sword more liberally and more often, the world would be a better place than it is today. In this instance, I concur. Yeah, this guy is not like your regular assassin where he gives peace and sends them away in a very beautiful Farewell, fashion. Edward. Okay. It's done. I've upheld my part of the bargain. I expect that you will honor yours. Follow me. No. No! You seem disappointed. I thought that I held a key that would open something here. This room is all there is. I expected more. What do they mean? It tells the story of Yotzitzizu, who came into their world and shaped it for what life might come. She had a hard journey, fraught with great loss and peril. But she believed in her children and what they might achieve. And though she is long gone from the physical world, her eyes still watch over us, her ears still hear our words. Her hands still guide us, and her love still gives us strength. Oh. 
You have shown me great kindness, dear. Thank you. I... I should go. Oh, she made the move first. Savage. Let's go. Let's go, Kenway. Get that in, boy. <laughs> yeah, <I'm stuck. laughs> the Braddock Expedition. Sequence three. Completed. A few days later. So we just laid down the smackdown in the middle of a cave. And now we're back here getting back to business in Boston. I like it. I really do. Guys, I, I really am enjoying this game. We are now at the beginning of sequence four. This game really is, it's a great game so far. And I just love how great it looks, how alive the world is. And the story's just completely different, which is something fresh. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you get, if you would like to see another episode ASAP, make sure you guys drop it a like. And um, as always, thank you for joining me. And I will catch you on the next one.